Hey, what's up, gamers? Welcome back to Joystick News. I hope you're all doing great because today we've got some massive news to talk about. If you're a Call of Duty fan, you'll want to stick around for this one. So let's dive right in. Cheating in online games, especially in a huge franchise like Call of Duty, is nothing new. But what's happening right now is shaking things up big time. Recently, Call of Duty launched a massive ban wave targeting thousands of cheaters in Modern Warfare 3 and Warzone. Yeah, you heard that right, thousands of accounts got the boot. Let's break down what's going on and what this means for the future of fair play in these games. Alright, first things first, why is this such a big deal? Well, cheating has always been a persistent thorn in the side of online gaming. It ruins the experience for everyone who just wants to have a good time and compete fairly. And Call of Duty, being one of the biggest games out there, has seen its fair share of cheaters. But this latest crackdown is one of the biggest we've seen in a while. The developers at Call of Duty with their Ricochet anti-cheat team went all out on this one. Over 65,000 accounts have been banned across both ranked and non-ranked modes. That's a massive number. The aim here is to clean up the leaderboards and make the game fair for everyone. This is especially important for those of you who love climbing the ranks and want to do it without running into cheaters every other match. Now, you might be wondering why the sudden surge in bans. Well, it turns out that with the release of Modern Warfare 3 on Xbox Game Pass, there was a noticeable spike in cheating incidents. What's interesting is that cheaters using the PC version from the Microsoft Store were being mistakenly identified as Xbox players. This little mix-up allowed them to fly under the radar for a bit, but of course the Ricochet team figured it out and addressed the issue. They've released an update to better distinguish between Xbox and PC players, which should help with cheat detection moving forward. But how's the community reacting to all of this? Well, it's a mixed bag. A lot of players are cheering this move, glad to see some serious action being taken against cheaters. It's a breath of fresh air for those of us who just want a fair game. On the flip side, there are some skeptics. They argue that banned cheaters will just create new accounts and be back to their old tricks in no time. It's a valid concern and something that needs ongoing attention. Speaking of ongoing attention, some players are calling for even stronger anti-cheat measures. They point to systems like Valorant's Vanguard as a possible solution. Vanguard is known for its robust cheat detection and prevention capabilities and some in the Call of Duty community think adopting a similar approach could be the key to finally putting a lid on cheating. So what does all this mean for you? If you're playing Modern Warfare 3 or Warzone, you should see a cleaner, fairer environment at least for a while. But remember, the fight against cheaters is never truly over. It's a game of cat and mouse, and it's up to the developers to keep up the pressure and keep the playing field level. Alright folks, I want to hear from you. What do you think about this massive ban wave? Is it enough to keep cheaters at bay, or do we need even stricter measures? Drop your thoughts in the comments below, and let's get the discussion going. I'm really curious to see what you all think. And hey, don't forget to smash that like button if you enjoyed the video and make sure to subscribe to Joystick News for more in-depth gaming news. Hit that bell icon so you never miss an update. We've got a lot more exciting content coming your way and you won't want to miss it. Until next time, keep playing fair, stay awesome, and I'll catch you in the next video. Peace!